I have checked and double checked and triple checked. I have done everything that it is possible to do in this game for me right now. I'm down to the very last quest. I have an idea of what's going to happen, but I've never played through it before. So this will be interesting. Uh, I'm a little surprised that the game is over already. It feels like it was a much shorter game than uh, Dragon Age Origins, even though I have recorded a lot more for this game than I did for Origins. Um, I think Origins had a lot more side quests that I didn't show. Um, yeah, time to go. Hopefully not screw it up somehow. Uh, that's the good thing about this being a video game. If I screw it up, I can just do it over again. Champion, thank the Maker you've come. What's happened? First Enchanter Orsino got into a terrible argument with the Knight Commander. He stormed off to bring the matter before the Grand Cleric, but the Knight Commander gave chase. I fear there will be blood. Wonderful. Take me to them. I will have the tower searched, top to bottom. You cannot do that! You have no right! I have every right. You are harboring blood mages, and I intend to root them out before they infect this city. Blood magic? Where do you not see blood magic? My people cannot sneeze without you accusing them of corruption. Do not trifle with me, mage. My patience is at an end. The wonder that I never saw it begin. The way you two carry on, people will talk. This does not involve you, Champion. I called him here. I think the people deserve to know just what you've done. What I have done is protect the people of this city time and again. What I have done is protect you mages from your curse and your own stupidity. And I will not stop doing it. I will not lower our guard. I dare not. Is there any truth to what she's saying? These are only her latest accusations, nothing more. And what if she does not find what she's looking for? How much further will she go to root out something that isn't there? The champion knows better than anyone how deep the circle's corruption goes. I must find the source. Does the word crazy mean anything to you? What other option do we have? Shall we look the other way? Tell the poor victims of a possessed mage that we meant no harm? Tell me, Champion, that you have not seen with your own eyes what they can do, heard the lies of mages that seek power. They're not the only ones that lie and seek power. You would cast us all as villains, but it is not so. I know, and it breaks my heart to do it, but we must be vigilant. If you cannot tell me another way, do not brand me a tyrant. This is getting us nowhere. Grand Cleric Athena will put a stop to this. You will not bring her grace into this. The Grand Cleric cannot help you. Explain yourself, mage. I will not stand by and watch you treat all mages like criminals, while those who would lead us bow to their Templar jailers. How dare you speak to the me? The Circle has failed us, Orsino. Even you should be able to see that. The time has come to act. There can be no half measures. Anders, what have you done? There can be no turning back. There can 
be no peace. Why? Why would you do such a thing? I removed the chance of compromise, because there is no compromise. The Grand Cleric has been slain by magic. The Chantry destroyed. As Knight Commander of Kirkwall, I hereby invoke the right of annulment. Every mage in the circle is to be executed. Immediately! The circle didn't even do this! Champion, you can't let her help us stop this madness! And I call on you to keep order. After what just occurred, you cannot deny what must be done. This is chaos. We must help the Knight Commander. No, this wasn't their fault. You can't possibly want the slaughter of innocent people, can you? It can't be stopped now. You have to choose. Was that why you needed me to distract the Grand Cleric? If you knew what I was doing, you would have felt honor bound to stop me. I couldn't take that chance. The Circle is an injustice. In many places beyond Kirkwall. The world needs to see. You fool. You've doomed us all! We were already doomed. A quick death now or a slow one later. I'd rather die fighting. You're a murderer. The Grand Cleric, the mages, their blood is on your hands. I know. It doesn't matter. Even if I wished to, I could not stay my hand. The people will demand blood. This won't be easy, but I'll defend you. I must stand for order, Hawk. Against you, if need be. After all the evil that magic has wrought, you would still support them. You sure about this? Even you might not win this fight. I know we can do this. I believe in you, Hawk. Ah, oh, shit. What have you gotten yourself into this time, Isabella? Think carefully, champion. Stand with them and you share their fate. I can live with that. Thank the Maker. It is a mistake, but I won't abandon you. I see what you are trying to do, and my place... is with you. You are a fool, champion. Kill them all! I will rouse the rest of the Order! Go! Get to the gallows before it's too late! So it's come to this. I don't know if we can win this war, champion, but... Thank you. I will leave your... friend for you to deal with. I must return to the gallows. Meet me there as soon as you can. There's nothing you can say that I haven't already said to myself. I took a spirit into my soul and changed myself forever to achieve this. This is the justice all mages have awaited. Did that spirit tell you to do this? No. When we merged, he ceased to be. We are one now. I can no more ignore the injustice of the Circle than he could. So you start a massacre to prove a point? I'm not proving a point. I'm changing a world. You've never been part of the Circle. I have. The people fear what we can do. But to use that fear to bludgeon us into submission is wrong. And they do it with our blessing. And if I pay for that with my life, then I pay. Perhaps then justice would at least be free. Opinions. Bold plan. Well, I thought so. He wants to die. Kill him and be done with it. Belief is no excuse. Sincerity does not justify this. He should come with us. Do what he can to put things right. I think I'm sick of mages and Templars. Whatever you do, just do it. 
You have to pay for what you've done. I know. The sooner I die, the sooner my name lives on to inspire generations. I've been looking everywhere for you. I thought you were dead. Here to cheer on the Templars, are you? Look, I know what happened in the Deep Roads. You saved my life, and I didn't even thank you. But you're the only family I have left. I have to stand by you. Just say the word and you'll have my blade. I thought the Order was supposed to be neutral. I'm a warden because of you. I blamed you for a long time, but... You saved more than my life. I'm so much more than I was. This is what I was meant to be. And I won't thank you by doing nothing while you start a war. Your blade would be welcome. The Hawk Brothers together again, huh? Just like old times. Stay where you are! There is no escape! Leave me alone. I never asked for any of this. The law is clear, mage. We cannot take the risk. Keep away from me. I'm warning you. time, hasn't it? I kind of like it. First Enchanter! Champion! You've survived, thank the Maker! We must- And here you are! Let us speak, Meredith! Before this battle destroys the city you claim to protect! I will entertain a surrender. Nothing more. Speak if you have something to say. Revoke the right of annulment, Meredith, before this goes too far. Imprison us if you must. Search the tower. I will even help you. But do not kill us all for an act we did not commit. The Grand Cleric is dead, killed by a mage. The people will demand retribution, and I will give it to them. Your offer is commendable, Orsino, but it comes too late. We can still prevent this, before you both tear Kirkwall apart. You heard her. She's wanted this all along. I'm disappointed in you, champion. So be it. You will share the Circle's fate. So what is it to be, Meredith? Do we fight here? Go. Prepare your people. The rest of the Order is already crossing the harbor. 
This isn't over. Shouldn't you be halfway to Tevinta by now? Maker's breath. Take off with a priceless relic once, and you never hear the end of it. Your life would have been easier if you had just cut me out of it. But you stood by me. You defied the Canari, and fought their Arashok for me, even after I betrayed you. If you'd gone with them, I wouldn't have been able to yell at you. Oh. Well... I'm glad you wanted to yell at me so badly, then. I know I don't exactly inspire confidence. But I swear, I'm going to come through for you this time. When you look for me, I'll be fighting at your side. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Or there's more to do, or... Does all this feel like a dream to you, too? In a moment, I'll look down and see I have no pants on. <laughs> the champion of Kirkwall going to battle naked. Why can't I ever have that dream? Hawk, before we go, I... Meryl, whatever happens, I'm proud to have known you. Can you stop them? Nervous, Hawk? The only part of this that worries me is, where are we going for the victory celebration? The hanged man was wrecked. <laughs> I think looters hit it before the fighting started. Nobody wants to pillage sober. You know me, Hawk. I'm not one for long goodbyes. I'm not sure we should be doing this. Helping dangerous people run amok. But I'm with you. We face down worse things than this, Varric. What could possibly go wrong? I hate it when you say that. What do you say we put an end to all this waiting around and go meet Destiny? Captain. Ah, uh, not for much longer if this goes bad. We're in for a mess now. How do you talk me into these things? Donick has kept the guard protecting civilians. Meredith will have no support from them. With luck, well, let's just say we need some luck. Starting to doubt me? Starting? These aren't Darkspawn. These were brothers of some sort just days ago. Don't make a bloody mess of it. Brother. You always seem to find a way to make my life difficult. I should be hunting archdemons, but... It feels right to be at your side again. Just don't go catching the Blight again, or whatever it is we mages carry. I'm pretty much the Walking Dead already, thanks. You kind of accept that as a Warden. So really, nothing to fear today except looking like an ass. Take care of that for me, will you? I've put in my time. I wish... I wish Mother could have seen us like this. I don't know what she would think about the rest, but... Don't make me tear up in front of the others, you jackass. Rubbed your collar with onions. Aveline's idea. I'm proud to call you brother. That's gone unsaid too long. In war, victory, champion. And whatever else may come. Here I am, about to defend these mages in hopeless battle. You lead me to strange places, Hawk. I'll take you to stranger places than this. Just watch. A tempting offer. I may not get the chance to say this again. Meeting you was the most important thing that ever happened to me, Hawk. Promise me you won't die. I can't bear the thought of living without you. 
I didn't quite catch that. Could you speak up? Then let me make it clearer for you. Are you prepared, champion? I believe the battle is almost upon us. You don't believe there's a chance of winning this fight? With you on our side? Perhaps. But even if we win, what then? More Templars would come, with even larger armies. We are apostates now. Our only hope lies in the circles elsewhere in Thetis. They could rise up with us against this injustice. I assure you, however, we will find sympathy nowhere else. Let the games begin. Very well. You will need to give orders to your companions, and I will do the same for my people. I want to help as well, even if I'm not fighting at your side. Meryl, attack from a distance. Stay out of the fight as much as you can. I will. Aveline, charge in whenever you see an opening. Very well. Isabella, I want you to fight from stealth. Keep them confused. <laughs> Sounds like fun. So, this is it. Some of you are worried. Maybe I am too, but I'm not staying long enough to find out. What I know is that I don't like being cornered. And I can fight harder scared than they can angry. We're getting out. And I'm buying when we do. Champion, it is beginning. as infants why wait why give us the illusion of hope I refuse to keep running I won't wait for her to kill me I hope you aren't giving up without taking a shot at Meredith I am not giving up I am giving in Quentin's research was too evil too dangerous so I put it aside but I see now there is no other way Meredith expects blood magic, then I will give it to her. Make her help us all.
Corporation, we are capable of anything. We cannot afford to remain here. What the fuck? How are you always right here? How does this happen? A jump mate? Sure, kid. Oh look, you even brought my storage chest with you. What the hell? There's a fucking dead pride demon. That's a fucking pride demon. That's the hardest demon to fight. Sandal, what are you? And here we are, champion. At long last. I imagine you've wanted to be rid of me for some time. I bear you no ill will. You've done this to yourself. You were never part of this circle, and I tolerated that. But in defending them, you've chosen to share their fate. Knight Commander, I thought we intended to arrest the Champion. You will do as I command, Cullen. No. I defended you when Thrask started whispering you were mad. But this is too far. I will not allow insubordination. We must stay true to our path! Andraste's dimpled butt cheeks. You recognize it, do you not? Your lyrium, taken from the deep roads. The dwarf charged a great deal for his prize. The idol poisoned Bartrand's mind in the end. He was weak. Whereas I am not. All of you! I want him dead! Enough! This is not what the Order stands for. Knight Commander, step down. I relieve you of your command. My own Knight Captain falls prey to the influence of blood magic. You all have. You're all weak. Allowing the mages to control your minds, to turn you against me. But I don't need any of you. I will protect this city myself. You'll have to go through me. Idiot boy. Just like all the others. She's lost it. Just like Bartrand. Blessed are those who stand before the corrupt and the wicked. And do not falter! Okay, this is gonna be fun. What? Why can I suddenly- Oh, she silenced me! Bitch! I forgot how much it sucks fighting Templars. begs you for the strength to defeat this evil!
Isabella and Aveline. And Cullen. No Meryl? No anyone? Hi! Oh! That's great! Nice to see you, dude! Come on! isn't actually going down, but the battle's not moving forward. And I'm not sure why. I'm not sure if it's because Nathaniel is trapped. Did I bug this thing? Is it bugged? Not enough that they make innocent suffer. No, we must also have insult added to injury. Give them freedom, and they would use it to tear down everything we hold dear. No, no, it cannot be allowed. I will stop it. Do you hear me, champion? I will defeat you. Defeated! Make her hate 
spread quickly. The champion's name became a rallying cry, a reminder that the mighty Templars could be defied. He had defended the mages against a brutal injustice, and many lived to tell the tale. The circles rose up and set the world on fire. More Templars arrived at Kirkwall to restore order, but we were already long gone. We vanished into the hills and circumstance eventually forced us all to leave the champion's side. Well, all of us except for Fenris. You still hear the stories, of course. With each telling they grow, even if at the core remains the truth. A new legend had been born. So that's it. That's the whole story. Then Meredith provoked the circle. She was to blame. Or that damned idol was. Or Anders. Take your pick. Even so, had the champion not been there... It might never have even gone that far. I see. So how is hearing all this going to help? You've already lost all the circles. In fact, haven't the Templars rebelled as well? I thought you decided to abandon the Chantry to hunt the mages. Not all of us desire war, Varric. Please, if you know where the champion is, you must tell me. He is a hero. A man that the mages would listen to. Someone who was there at the beginning. The champion could stop this madness before it's too late. He may be the only one who can. Is that what this is all about? In that case, I wish I could help you. Just tell me one thing, then. Is the champion dead? Though, I doubt that. Then you are free to go, Beric. May the Maker watch over you during the dark times ahead of us. Same to you, Seeker. Same to you. So, did you... Gone. Just like the Warden. That is no coincidence. So, do we proceed with the original plan? Or keep looking? It is in the Maker's hands now. We put our faith in him. Particularly, I don't know, Dragon Agey. That's the, the 
Bioware! Fuck you! <laughs> Fuck you so much! How long were you planning this? Ooh, I have to play Inquisition. I have to play Inquisition right now. But I have so much planning to do. Crap! Okay. I'll be back soon.